British Prime Minister Boris Johnson is setting out tougher rules for inmates convicted of terror offences after an Islamist attacker injured two people in a stabbing spree on Sunday. Days after, he was set free halfway through his three-year prison term. The attacker has now been named by police as Sudesh Aman, who was jailed in 2018 for possession and distribution of terror documents. Aman was shot dead by police after he went on the rampage with a stolen 10-inch knife on a busy South London street. More details have emerged that he previously praised the Islamic State militant group, shared an online Al-Qaeda magazine and encouraged his girlfriend to behead her parents. There had been no current legal mechanism in place to have prevented Suresh Aman's early release, but he was under police surveillance at the time of the attack. Johnson said the government would announce fundamental changes to the system for dealing with those convicted of terror offences. We're bringing forward legislation to stop the system of automatic early release, but the difficulty is how to apply that, uh, I see the AG in the front row, how to apply that retrospectively to the cohort of people who currently qualify. The Islamic State's AMAC News Agency have said the group since claimed responsibility for the South London attack. However, no evidence has been put forward to verify what part it may have played.